Now it's your turn. In exercise one, you will simulate drift diffusion model with fixed time stopping rule. You will first need to follow the suggestions in the notebook and write codes to simulate a drift diffusion model with fixed lengths. After that, you can run some simulations from randomly generated data and use our provided code to plot the accumulated evidence as a function of time. You should get a plot like this after completing this exercise, where the noisiness may differ depending on your measurement noise le level. After finishing it, please also use the sliders to play with different noise levels and different stopping times. In exercise two, let's look at the speed accuracy trade-off for fixed time stopping rule. You can now calculate the average accuracy given a stopping time by running multiple repeated simulations. Do this for a range of different stopping times and use our provided code to visualize how accuracy changes with stopping time. And don't forget to try different values of noise levels and see how that affects the curve.